When you put all that together and you find out, oh, it's written by his own hand upon papyrus and found in the catacombs of Egypt, it gets harder to talk about this in terms of a copy of a copy of a copy of a copy. I don't want to take up too much time here, but I do have to note that the only reason this argument has to be made at this point is because in Joseph Smith's day, yeah, this could have been papyrus written by Abraham. It was just as likely as anything else. But now that the field of Egyptology has grown, blossomed, matured, and become established since that time, what we know and what Egyptologists know is that this document came from around the first century BCE. That's when this document was produced, which is well over 1,500 years after anybody thinks that Abraham is purported to have lived. 